welcome in your classical dance class. And I'm hoping that you all are enjoying your classical dance class, Kathak. Okay, so today is the third lesson. Yes, third lesson of our dance class. So, uh, in our previous lesson, I have given you the technique of how to maintain the correct posture as well as how to tie the bells, the bhumrus, and how to do the correct matras, how to count the matras, how to do the theka, and how to do the tatkar. Yes, again I am repeating that we have already learned that tatkar, what is tatkar? The footwork is called tatkar and what is theka? The hand moment, the hand work, okay, the tal, uh, which is just given on the palm by your hand, this is called theka. And the same thing, when we practice by our feet, this is called exactly tatkar. So remember the difference between theka and tatkar. And uh, what was the theka? We are learning teen tal. Yes, we are learning teen tal. And teen tal has 16 digit. Remember, teen tal has 16 digit. And what was that digit? It was, I think, dha, then, then, dha, dha, then, then, dha, dha, then, then, ta, ta, then, then, dha, and ta. So, have you practiced this lesson? Okay, you practice it that wonderfully. It means you are prepared to do our next class. So, and we have also practiced the same theka on our feet, and that is ta, te, te, ta, te, a, te, te, ta, te, ta, te, te. Okay, so what is this? Don't feel overwhelmed because when we are doing the footwork, okay, the same theka will be called, will be known as ta thai thai tat a thai thai tat ta thai thai tat a thai thai tat don't feel confused the theta theta's bowl is dha din din dha dha din din dha dha din din ta ta din din dha dha and the footwork the tatkar bowl is Ha. Sorry, we are not going to start it from the, yes, now we will practice it from the original bowl that is ta, yes, ta, te, te, ta, ta, a, te, te, same thing, we are repeating the same thing as we have practiced, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Focus on my leg. Yes. And how it is performed? Same thing we are performing. Ta, te, te, ta, ta, a, te, te, ta, 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 te, te. Ta, ta, a, te, te, ta. 
now we will learn the hand movement of kathak we are starting the coordination of our hand with our footwork it means the digit should be same ta the the ta a the the ta and we have to coordinate it with our hand so how i am going to do this just try to do it with me like first we start from right side this is ta the the ta ta a the the ta the ta the the ta the a the the ta the ta the the ta the a the the ta the ta the the ta the a Now you practice with me. You have to coordinate your foot along with your hand movement. The mudra should be in pataka mudra. This is the pataka mudra. Okay, this is the pataka mudra, and you have to do this hand movement with pataka mudra. Yes, hand 
moment is called hasta in the language of Qatar. So how is it performed? The second hand movement is called palta. Remember that if I have started it from here and ending it here, in the second hand movement we are starting it from here and will end up it here. Remember that there are uh, at least 9 to 10 kinds of hasta we have to learn in katha. Yes, at least 9 to 10 kinds of hasta you have to be perfect in. So, this is your second hasta. And how is it done? Ta, te, te, ta, ta, a, te, te, ta, 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 te, te, ta, ta, a, te, te, ta, 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 te, te, ta, ta, a, te, te, ta, 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 te, te, ta, ta, a. Okay, set. Now, practice it with me. We are starting from here. From right side. And while doing this, you have to spread your hand widely. You have to spread your hand widely. Ta, te, te. So the first hand movement is ta te te ta ta a te te ta 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 te te ta ta a te te ta. Now the second hand movement is ta te te ta ta a te te. Da da ta, te, te, da da a, te, te, da da ta, te, te, da da a, te, te, da da ta, te, te, da da a, te, te, da da ta, te, te, da da a, te. Actually, these hand movements are the 
power out of Kathak. Yes, these are the good workout if you are a classical dancer and that's why we always start our class from practicing a lot of hand movements along with the footwork to warm up our body to give a very good performance or to or to do a very intense kathak training yes so for very good kathak training this is very important that you first you practice a lot of footwork and with the coordination of your hand movements so this was your third lesson of kathak and in further we will practice many more hand movements okay so you have to practice it because practice makes you perfect so children see you next time in my next class till then take care bye bye be safe